attacked as he does running the football. It says a lot about him as a guy. The flag is down. Pass is caught by Williams. Wide open. But a flag is thrown. And now another on the far side of the field. And sportsmanlike conduct. Offense. Number 19 came into the huddle as a substitute and did not participate and left the field. 15 yard penalty, repeat second down. Now oh, that's a costly penalty after a huge game. Mike Pereira, there's also a flag on the other side of the field, but first talk us through what Butler was guilty of. Yeah, this is not an illegal substitution where you may come in just to the numbers and turn around and go back. If you actually enter the huddle and then leave the huddle without participating in the play, then it becomes unsportsmanlike conduct. There he is, 19. Bryce Butler is all the way in the huddle and then comes out. And there was a flag on the far side of the field that they picked up about around the 20. McCarthy is going to question the spot of the ball. Mike Pereira, Tony Correnti said it was a 15-yard foul. They marked it as a five-yard penalty. The question was about the enforcement of the penalty, whether it was a five or a 15-yard penalty. It is a 15-yard penalty, and it was only marked as five. We will add the additional 10 yards before we get the ball in play. Was a catch by Mike McCarthy on the sideline, or instead of second down and 10, they marched the ball all the way back to the 48 of Dallas. That's a big mistake by Butler. Also erased the completion that was going to take the ball inside. That's why. Yeah, you think of where they would have the ball right now after that completion to Williams, and now they're faced with second and 20. For Butler, broken up and what a play by Micah Hyde. He's got a sack in this game and now he makes a perfect play on that throw to Bryce Butler. He really does because initially it looked like he might try to undercut this ball when it was in the air. They may be able to come underneath it and he stays up on the top shoulder and he's able to make a play on it without going through the receiver. So already in this game, Micah Hyde has, has made some nice plays on the ball. And, to reiterate what you said earlier, Joe, what a versatile player he has been. He made this team because he was a heck of a slot player off the edge as a blitzer, and he's had to wear a lot of different hats.